things that we've got to clean up. Um, obviously, you know, if you, if you if you don't address those things, they're definitely going to catch up to you. So we got some work to do tomorrow before Monday, regardless of who wins this game. Did you tell early that Ashton was kind of, I could say, in the zone? I mean, she was, right from the beginning, she was. Yeah, no, this is the best she's looked, all, you know, in the last seven or eight days. You know, she's, uh, she, I think she puts a tremendous amount of pressure on herself. And sometimes that gets the best of her. And I was just, I, I was really worried that, you know, the Big East tournament is, is a big stage. And you don't need to be putting any more on yourself. And it's, it's already there. So when she came out and started the way she started, um, it, it, I think it, you know, made her feel really, really good. And it, it you know, kind of made us like, Paige needs another scorer out there to take some of the pressure off. And uh, Aaliyah was terrific. Aaliyah did what a, a senior supposed to do. Paige did what a senior supposed to do. And um, and Ash is that, that third, you know, today. And that's huge going forward. You'd sign up for three and 20 right now for the rest of the tournament, wouldn't you? Um, yeah, I would, I would sign up for that. Absolutely. Um, I, I would, I would, I would like to think that, that they're certainly capable of doing that, you know, and I'd like to see our, our, our I'd like to see us be a little bit more disciplined on the defensive end so that Paige doesn't have to play that many minutes. But when you get your guards getting a little bit of foul trouble, you know, KK and, and Nika, now you're like, and you're kind of stuck a little bit, so we need to clean that up a little bit. Tina, what was your favorite T-shirt you saw in that locker room? <laughs> um, man, um, I, I'm not sure I liked any of them. <laughs> <laughs> Certainly none from the '70s. I don't think that was a good look at all. <laughs> I can't imagine that we all thought that was okay back right then. Um, <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> so moment in there? You know, yeah, yeah. I mean, yeah, I wouldn't mind going back to my Frankie Avalon <laughs> look back then, but that was after that. No, no. I don't know where they got them. I don't know how they came up with it. I don't know whose idea it was. But I did get a laugh out of it. I did get a kick out of it. Huh? Um, right now, the only thing we have is, um, you know, we got a visitor here that we, you know, um, we're going to spend some time with. And after that, um, I don't know. This is one of the few times where I'm home during the NCAA tournament on my birthday. Most of the time we're on the road. So I'm glad that we get a chance to spend some time with my with my family. Was it good to see Aaliyah smack someone instead of getting smacked so many times? Yeah, I mean, some of the stuff, you know, I get it. You know, uh, it's, you know, we we generally don't foul a lot. We generally play pretty good defense. And uh, today I thought we did some dumb things. But at the same time, there's, there's a lot of physical stuff going on out there. And you have to be able to hang in there and, and deal with it. That's all there is to it. But I thought Aaliyah, I was worried that will she be able to feel comfortable enough with the physicality of it, and she did. You know, I think I thought she was magnificent on the boards the whole game. You know, how, do you, how do you stoke the fire for them that, you know what, you guys can do this, and even if maybe you're not odds on favor to do this whole thing, you know, do you motivate them? Do you have to motivate them? Um, I don't think you, I mean, if you have to motivate people to play well in the NCAA tournament, you got the wrong team and no amount of motivational tactics is, are going to work, you know? You have to have people that believe in themselves, that believe they belong on this stage and can perform on this stage. You know, you tell players, hey, it's just like any other game. No, it's not. It's the NCAA tournament. So they know that and they know you're lying to them. It's not like any other game. But you can say we need to do all the things that we did well during the course of the year. And that hopefully is enough. Um, but, yeah, we're, we're certainly not, you know, we're not the betting favorite, I don't think. No. We're a three seed for 
for a reason, I guess, there's at least eight other teams ahead of us. So, you know, we play one game at a time, see where it takes us. Welcome and um, we're showing you the techniques to help your What's a seven year old's bedtime these days? What's seven year old what? The bedtime these days. Bedtime? Yeah. What's seven year old bedtime? Uh, last night it was really late because I couldn't get to sleep. You know, the night before a game or in, during the NCAA tournament, it's really hard to sleep. It's really hard to sleep for me anyway. Just too many things running around in my head. So, you know. You do your best, you know, you try red wine, white wine, sometimes scotch. You just got to mix it up, you know, you're like, you can't, you can't be boring. Uh, my God. If you ever wish Paige could do defensively what gets it done to her. Oh, my God. You know, she's a whiner, but she has a right to whine. She gets hit. People don't believe me They're from out of town, you know, that you don't see it. When you watch how she's officiated relative to other people are officiated that are supposedly star power, people get away with murder against her. That's why I lose my mind when they, when they, you know, a bump that's a foul for someone else is not a foul on her because what well, has Paige Beckers? She'll score anyway. Well, that's not the point. If you get hit, you get hit. So, no, yeah, no, I, I, I how do you keep her from getting frustrated? How do I feel from getting frustrated? I mean, you can see because it, it's... It's obvious. I mean, everybody sees it. Everybody knows it. But you can't get frustrated because then they've done their job. Then they've gotten you to be outside your comfort level. And no, the way you handle that stuff is you get a bucket and you foul people out. You have to be physical and... Not, I'm not saying she loves playing like that, but she's gotten better at it. She's gotten better at it. Let's put it that way. Thank you. Yeah.